I bury the emptiness stifling me behind the wall. Oh, night riding in Tokyo was awesome. Um, we rode around real slow. Traffic was really nice to us. We ended up at this big tower, having a very good time. That bike's pretty much the perfect match for anything, man. It's a cyclocross bike, and the great thing about cyclocross bikes is you can ride them anywhere. And uh, yeah, it's been wonderful today. It's super comfortable. I can ride it all day. I'm going up to the Nobuyama cyclocross race uh, this weekend. You know, this is my race bike. And uh, it's awesome because, I mean, that's kind of the whole point of, of All City is this is my race bike, but I ride it every day. It's not something that I just put away and, you know, take out on the weekends or when it's nice out or it's just my bike and I ride it all the time, but yet I can take it to this high-end cyclocross race and do very well on it. Um, you know, it's hard to say what's the most important thing. You know, basically we just want to make really good bikes. But you know, what's important to us is uh, we love steel bikes, we love those classic touches that used to exist in production bikes and were kind of lost. And we want to bring those back, you know, like the braised on seat collars and the custom dropouts and the internal cable routing. And uh, we want to do those kind of classical things, but really bring it into the modern era, which is, you know, like if you see this bike here, it's got a carbon fork, it's got a 44 mil head tube, um, but yet it has a very classic look about it. So it's really about updating the things that we love from the past and bringing them into modern performance. If I had to have a message to to the Japanese bike riders, just, you know, whatever bike you're on, have fun out there. You know, that's what it's all about. People take this stuff kind of seriously and. Ride your bike and have fun.